Family, what's good? Welcome back. Another Hello. episode, Smoke Cask and Barrel. I am Daryl. You see Randy Miller around the background, but I'm happy about this one. We have, I always say sponsors, but I'm glad to have our brother with us, Dwayne We're Jarrett. Brothers. We're brothers. Uh, Prime 357. Uh, I mean, like I said, we, as family, man, we, we sitting here smoking some good cigars and everything. Um, so, as we get into this, we got some whiskey. We'll talk about that here in a second and everything. But uh, while we're here, I got my brother here. Like I said, you see Randy Miller around the back. Um, that being said, welcome, Dwayne. Thank you. Thank you. Glad to have you here. We are in the Cosmo Night nice Social Club as always. And before we get started, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, give us a thumbs up. That always helps the channel. And then share the content. Get your mama, auntie, cousins, uncles, all them on here. Make sure they messing with us. But he said, "Ask some kids." No, it's strictly twenty-one and up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. Just joking. <laughs> Hey, don't be putting your kids on this stuff. Not yet. Um, that being said, we got Dwayne here. I'm going I'm to shut up. I'm going to ask some questions. We want to talk a little bit. We're really hyped about this. Like I said, we did the uh, Sip and Smoke a while back and kind of got a good little launch with everything. Uh, Dwayne's got the website going. Again, before we go any further, we said this on the previous episode. This is not his own cigar brand. Okay? We don't want nobody... Getting that confused. Right. <laughs> no confusion. Right. But that being said, what we're uh, proud about is it's a black owned retailer in cigar, uh, mm -hmm. in the cigar industry. Um, so just talk to us a little bit, man. Give me the vision, kind of what it is that kind of got you led in this. All right. Uh, the vision, Prime 357, was to uh, provide uh, good quality cigars for uh, affordable prices and to serve our community. Um, we spend a lot of time out in the different cigar bars and, and uh, cigar shops. And after spending so much money there, I was like, why Absolutely. not spend it <laughs> right. with us right? and, and uh, provide the service for our, ourselves? So Prime 357 was born. And um, it started out um, uh, being a, um, I started out wanting to do a website. That proved to be a little challenging. Okay. Uh, so it took me about a year. Okay. To to get the uh, website up and going, but now we're we're up and going, and uh, the website actually just went live last week. Okay. www prime the number three five seven cigars with a s. We will provide a link for you. We'll put yeah. the link in the description. I'm sure below. it'll be on the bottom of the screen. Yeah. Someplace down here. Yeah, it's gonna be in the description below. Make sure you get on there and check that out. I, I want to highlight some stuff real quick before we start getting into this cigar and whiskey stuff. But for uh, entrepreneurs that are watching this, especially for those of us in the black community, I want you, I hope you pay attention to what he said. It took a year a to year. really just kind of get things sorted out, figured yeah, out. It, it took six months to get uh, my tobacco sales license. Okay. Um, now, of course, I was trying to do that during COVID. So Man. that that slowed things down a little bit. But uh, the web. Uh, creating the website proved to be a little bit more difficult than I thought. But um, now I'm proud to say that it's up and it's running. Um, go check it out. We have about 30 selections of cigars okay. right now. Uh, and more are being added every week. And I mean, this ain't, you know, this ain't the, and there's no knock premium to that. Premium cigar. This is premium cigar brands. I mean, these are your, like you said, we, we always talk about Placencias. This is Aging Room. This is Oliva. Uh, this is Macanudos, so on and so forth. I mean, these are premium brands, and they're at great pricing. Um, what? I know you say you got about 30 brands right now. Right now, just off the top of your head, if you can, give me what is kind of like a brand that's kind of been moving pretty, pretty big for you right now. Uh, uh, definitely the Placentius. Okay. Uh, right now we have the uh, Hexagon, the... Uh, yeah, fantastic cigar. Great smoke. I haven't had a bad Placencia yet. I haven't if, either. If there's one out there, I haven't had it yet. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
uh, the 146s. Okay. And uh, uh, just here last week, got in the uh, red label, the um, Fuego. Fuego. Fuegos, yeah. Thank you. Um, and great smokes. As always, the Leva V's are always good. Been my go-to for forever. And the thing about the Oliva V's, a lot of people don't know, Oliva moved a lot of their cigar rolling with the V's into Miami, Florida. So they, uh, that was actually a big deal. I think it's a big deal to bring that stateside to do that. They actually brought a lot of that in. Um, great smoke. I mean, that's that's one of those everyday things. I've been pounding the placentias pretty heavy myself right now. Oh, yeah. A lot of people have. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. You can't come through the humidor and find the Absolutely. You can't wait too long to I mean, look, we talking about buying black, baby. That's what we talking about. Cosmo Nice Social Club got the placenta. They got the Fuegos. They got the Almafuertes in. They have the 146s. You get the whole line here. Come in. Get you a nice pour or something and get you a quality premium smoke, okay? This, they, I mean, come on, y'all. We talk about black excellence all the time. This is what we're talking about. This is what we represent. Um, so where, where is there an expansion with that? You got the website going. Are you looking to do any expansion? Maybe, I don't know, mail, mail, monthly club or club or anything like that? Or is there a prospect? I know it's probably down the line because it's in a minute. But, I mean, is there a prospect? That you yeah, do I some mean, stuff it's with funny that? You, you asked that because uh, just today I was talking about just that. Uh, doing a... Um, a subscription service where you can get, you know, um, a selection of cigars every month, every week, you know, and have different um, setups available. Nice. Uh, that that's not yet, but that not that yet. will be coming soon. And uh, of course, as always, when that does happen, you will get that news through Smoke Cask and Barrel exclusive. Uh, <laughs> that being said, so I, I like I said, we got our brother here. Uh, Randy's loving this because he ain't got to get in the microphone. And, 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 I, I, <laughs> and, and let me add this too while, while we're talking about this. Um, if, and I'm sure we'll, we'll put this on the screen, that if you watch this episode, we'll put a coupon code on there to get 10% off your next order. Boom. There you, there you go. You got it right here. So don't say you ain't get plugged in, okay? Don't say you didn't get plugged in. Right, uh, and all, all the accessories as well. Uh, lighter just left. But, yeah, but yeah, we have ashtrays, accessories. Um. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, it's a really nice lighter. It was a gift to me, so. Right, I, I had to hook my brother up. Membership have its privileges. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Favor ain't fair. Favor ain't fair. <laughs> so, that being said, we asking some questions, but I want to highlight this, what we have in front of us. I like to consider, for me, this particular bottle, I like to call goat. I got goat bottles in my name. And, and for me, this is a Heaven Hill offering. Heaven Hill's doing some great distilleries on that. <laughs> she try to switch out the mic. Heaven Hill's doing some great stuff. As always, that's where you're, uh, you're, you know, with a lot of their whiskeys and stuff. Um, if you've been following... There's a traditional Elijah Craig, that's the 94 proof, that's their everyday offering. Um, but for sure in the last couple of years, for me anyway, I know for us, we started getting into a lot of their barrel proofs. And they do an A, B, and a C batch. And we'll do an episode or a time, we'll talk about that as far as batches and barrelings and things like that. So this particular one is the A121. Uh, this is their barrel proof. This is coming in at 123.6 proof. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> and so you'll find the variations between the batches between A, B, and C. They do uh, offering uh, A, B, and C every year. So, of course, with it being 2021, they have the A121 came out. I believe the B121 has dropped, just dropped. We'll have that coming down the line. Uh, there'll be an episode coming. We're going to do some comparisons because I know I've got some of the uh, uh, 120s from uh, 2020. Um, but uh, this is, like I said, this is, and, and the crazy part is with this particular one, this isn't the proof, is the highest proof that they put out. Their A proof, their A batches are typically their lower proofs. Um, this is, like I said, 123. 
Uh, the B's kicks up somewhere. Usually a lot of times they're in the 127, 128s. And then when you get to the C batches, them the big boys. Them the 132s, 133s. I think they've had some get up to the 34s. I'm not for sure. But, yeah, this is um, – we talk about weekend bottles, you know, with the things you're getting into, not your daily sippers. This is one of those ones, a weekend bottle. Uh, like I said, this is the traditional uh, big bourbon notes, caramel, vanilla. You're going to get some barrel char. I mean, man, a lot of caramel. Yeah. I mean, this is... Oh, man, yeah. This is... I, I'm a big fan of the Elijah Craig Barrel Proof, so I'm going to tell you right off the bat before we even get into pricing and grades, this is already an A-plus in my book. But that's just my personal opinion. I know a lot of people don't like them. You know, it depends on what it is. Uh, for me, this is an A-plus. I prefer the C-batches. I'm a proof whore. I like the high proofs. Um, but this is, like I said, Heaven Hill, you can't ever go wrong. It's probably one of my favorite distilleries, really, with everything. Um, I, I, I tend to lean towards another distillery. We'll talk about that in another episode. But Elijah Craig is just one of those ones. Hey, hidden fact, if you ain't know, just so you know, Elijah Craig is named after a Baptist preacher. <laughs> he founded whiskey. This is one of his things he did. So Message. <laughs> so I'll this is one of the ones. I drink to that, right. We'll drink to that. Uh, mm. <laughs> this is, yeah, buddy. 123. Yeah, tell us uh, about, yeah. yeah. I mean, for yeah, something like this, because I know, like, because this. you weren't drinking a whole lot of stuff uh, until you actually started coming around. So, uh, of your experience. Absolutely. Uh, since I'm um, starting to hang out with these brothers, they really uh, increased my knowledge of uh, what a good bourbon is um, and I've really enjoyed the the experience I you know admittedly don't know a lot of, near as much as, as you guys do but I've really been enjoying the the experience and um, looking forward to, to learn a lot more um, I don't know all the notes I don't know all the proofs I know it's good. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Shouts out to Gregory Merriweather, brother. We can see you out there. Uh, <laughs> that's his criteria. If it's just good, it's, it's good. I'm going to smash it. Right. Um, you know, and, and one thing about us on this channel, we don't know everything, but, I, you know, we want to give it from the approach of just the kind of the everyday, I guess, like a better term, blue collar person. You know what I mean? We, we, you know, where's a good bottle to go to, whatever the case is like that. Um, this particular one, like I said, I'm a big fan of it. Uh, these are Elijah Craig's. When you're able to find them, shout out to Community Spirits again for this bottle. Uh, when you're able to find them, this is going to cost you about that $65, $70 range for this bottle. Um, it is highly allocated. I, I say it's highly allocated because uh, when these batches come out and they drop and they go to the different stores and things like that, they sell quick. So if you find it, you know, get your hands on one. I know it's a budget buster. I try to buy two at a time because I know usually if it's something I like a lot, I'm going to probably crush that first one <laughs> and have the second one sit in the bar. Um, but for everybody, you know, whiskey is, and, and, and you start getting the whiskey, you know, scotches and, and, and bourbons and getting into uh, Japanese whiskeys and American whiskeys and so on and so forth. The best whiskey is the what you're drinking at that time and how you want to drink it. Why so we let a price point dictate what you truly like. Absolutely. I mean, because you can get a bottle that you pay $150 for that tastes nothing and it's not good compared. We sell our time to a bottle that maybe $30, you know. Um, don't get caught up on pricing. I, like I said, I try it. Try it. You never know what you're discovering, what you like with that. Try it. Don't be scared of it. Now, if you know you don't like high proofs, this is not going to be a bottle for you. I can tell you right now, get away from it. Don't even go to it. If you don't like high proof, proofy bottles, don't mess with this. Um, but this is something you're looking to get into. Some more of your bigger bourbons, your bigger bottles and flavors. And, and it's not a beginner shipper at all. I mean, it's going to blow you out. You get the hug. It's going to hit you in the back of the throat and the chest. I mean, yeah, you all feel? that. <laughs> it's going to hit hey, you all there. Let me add this, though. Um, try it, though. Try it. Yeah, yes. e even if you don't think you will like it, try it. Because I, I didn't think I would like some of this either, but I've been introduced to some great bourbons and some great drinks, and, and, and I find myself enjoying it a lot more. And it is a method to how you drink it too, though. 
I mean, I you know, I know in our culture we used to try and shoot everything and put shots down, put them back. Yeah, definitely. This is not gonna be one of one. You're gonna want to just don't, shoot. Don't do that. Nah, <laughs> get you a good pour, <laughs> sit back and enjoy it. And like I said, you know, in this lifestyle, pair with a good cigar. Uh, we're finishing up some stuff. I know. I think he has an undercrown. I just switched to Avo. Randy's on the Avo Classics, which is always a great cigar as well. I'm I'm finishing off an aging room. I mean, I've got a lunatic over here in the ashtray. I'm going to finish off. Um, you know, find your parent. Find something that you like. Discover it. You know, take your time with it. One thing about, you know, we talk about it a lot. And, you know, with what you're, you know, retailing the cigars and everything. And you could probably speak a little bit more to this. I know for myself with cigars, I look for that to be that moment that I'm sitting down. And I get to just wash away what the day was. You know, even if it's been a great day, mm -hmm. you know. Um, I just get that chance to sit down, think, get my own thoughts, and, and get a chance to kind of clear my head a little bit. For for you, like, what is a go-to cigar or size or something like that for you? With you know, you retail a lot of different ones, but what is a good what's a good go-to for you? For that, that uh, a good go-to uh, for me is the um, uh, Oliva Robusto. Okay, and uh, like you said, um, one of the joys of smoking cigars is the fact to do it right, you have to slow down. Yes. You know, it's not something you you do when you're you're ripping and running. You have to, if you do it right, you have to sit down, you have to slow down. And that's one of the joys of smoking cigars. Yes. Yeah. A a mo yeah, moment. That's right. That's moment. right. And, and, and a lot of times we don't take that moment. It's not like smoking cigarettes and, yeah. and other things that you well, might smoke. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> the lettuce. <laughs> the devil's lettuce. It, 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 you ain't coming to hit this mug three or four times. Yeah, right. This is that time, that yeah, hour, two hours to sit down. That's right, yeah. and, and just to slow down and enjoy the moment. Yeah, and I mean, here at Cosmos, that's what it's about. It ain't about the turn up. You know, we can get all that in and everything like that, but this is, Cosmos lends itself to what we like to consider professionals. Uh, we get a chance to network, socialize over a good cigar, a good drink, a uh, chance to listen to some good music, and laugh and talk. We can cut up just as much as anybody else can when we're doing having that time. I think all of us agree Absolutely. with that. We have a great time together, but that fellowship in that moment to know that we get to that day, especially like a Friday night or a Saturday, to get to that moment that I get to sit down with my brethren and have a good time. The ladies, they bring, you know, sit with their sisters. We all sit down, have a good time, socialize, and you know, there's no levels as to trying to say, okay, you know, somebody trying to judge what it is somebody has on or whatever the case is. It's about that cigar and it's about that drink to have that moment. Um, so, you know, that's what we that's what it's about. Um, again, let's get that website. WWW Prime 357 Cigars. And that's the number 357 with that. Make sure you get on that site. I'm going to go ahead and throw that up again one more time for you. Make sure you get on that. It's cigars with the S on that. Prime 357, get with him, see that site, order you some stuff, spend your money, buy black, there's nothing wrong with it. And don't get me wrong, we got a lot of other retailers and things that we all support. We all, you know, this culture and this lifestyle is not everywhere, but we support everybody. But we definitely want you to support our own, support the brands and the companies that support us, okay? Absolutely. As he talked about that, you know, we do it, there's a lot of philanthropy that happens. We give a lot back to communities. Uh, community spirits, shout out to them and throw them up there. Prime three, uh, Prime three five seven community spirits. There's a lot that happens that they give back to the communities, uh, feeding, all that kind of stuff like that. You know, it's more than that to, to, to us. You know, I know alcohol. You know, represents a turn up. Everybody wants to get into all that, but you know, to have that moment to sit down and do that and be professionals about it and have a good time, laugh, and just relax. I love this lifestyle. For me, it is a part of my life, very much a part of my life. Yeah. And uh, I'm grateful for it. I enjoy it. So and we also appreciate Cosmos for, for giving us this. Absolutely. Uh, opportunity and venue this in place. order to do it. Absolutely. It, it's, I mean, come on, man. I mean, what, what more could you ask for in this? And we always talk about, you know, being underrepresented or misrepresented mm -hmm. in our community with that. Black owned cigar lounge, black owned, and and the excellence in here and that's with that. Black owned cigar retailer, okay. We're gonna get into some black owned whiskeys and things with that. Black owned cigar makers. We're really trying to do that to help push that forward. We're grateful for everyone. Community spirits, black owned liquor retailer. You know, spirits retailer. This is a big deal to us. This is what we represent. 
and we're trying to make sure we get that out to everybody. We just, we're preaching this gospel everywhere. And as we're preaching it, we're having a good time enjoying ourselves yeah, <laughs> with these I'm, things. I'm done. So, a <laughs> $70 bottle. You can pour your another you want one. Um, like I said, $70 bottle. Elijah Craig, batch A121, about 70 bucks, 65, 70 bucks. Like I said, for me, it's an A+. Plus. I don't know. What y'all feel about it? So, hey, I'm yeah. Elijah Craig fan. Here you have it. So, again... We said it before, make sure you're buying. Shop with Community Spirits, Eagle Creek Liquors. Make sure you're shopping with them. He does the bourbon show, and he invite only to his customers, okay? Make sure you do that. Get familiar. We'll do an episode on that. Man, we have to do an episode on that. When you go into the store and you start buying some of these rare bottles, sometimes take it back in there and, and share it with some of the people that's, that's, that's serving you. You know, let them taste that because they may not get a chance to get their hands on it and taste it. Do things like that. Build your community up and, and share it with someone. You never know what they're able to discover. You may put some people onto some things they may have never had before. Yeah, and that, that's a great thing about this atmosphere. It's it's all about sharing. Yes. It's all about learning. Yeah. More about cigars, more about bourbons, more about uh, the whole culture yeah. of uh, cigar and bourbon. Because we want to get... i knocking you if you're a newbie or amateur or whatever you classify yourself as. Right. Because, I mean, more than anything, man, it, it's... That's the I love it. I mean to explore that. Ain't nobody no snobs, man. And this is this is really we enjoy doing this and we enjoy being a part of it. I'm sure that played into a big part of you wanting to start this this company. Uh, absolutely. You know, we enjoy it. I mean, this is something we enjoy. So that being said, big shouts out again to my brother, Dwayne Jerry. He came Thank up and sponsored the show. Thank you for coming on, talking with us a little bit. Make sure you get onto that website again, Prime Three Five Seven Cigars. Get on there, order you some product. Let them know we sent you. We're gonna put a link in here. Get your coupon, ten percent off. Share that, okay? It's gonna be something representing Smoke Cask and Barrel with that. And then we want to shout out again our family over there, Community Spirits, Charles Everhart, the whole team, Adrian, CJ, everybody. We thank y'all for what you do for us and helping us out with this channel. That being said, I'm Daryl. I'm Dwayne. Randy back there in the backdrop. He's happy not to be on there. <laughs> <laughs> it's been another one with Smoke Cask and Barrel. Love y'all. Peace. Peace.